So now I'm just going to go through some of the most important things that you can add to your project library besides your screenplays and your text and your schedules. And those are some of just these items. And the first one I want to do is a character description. So if you remember, the real easy way to add it is either hit this or hit add or right click and add an item. And of course you want to add a character and I'm just going to open up uh, one they already have to uh, give you the uh, just an example. So this is what your, your character item is going to look like. And you can see of course it opened up in a tab and first off it just says character profile, Dorothy. And then you can enter in full name and a description. You can also enter in media from either your computer or the internet. You can even change the name right there and can add new stuff and you can see it goes um, uh, well it's looking on my computer so if you did find something on the internet and something like a Google image search just right click and save it on your computer and then you could add it to this. You've got a, a detailed physical description which of course is always this is all important stuff that you want to know about your characters if you're going to be writing a screenplay. Age, distinguishing features, eyes, weight, height, hair. Um, the next box over here, character traits. Um, sincere, loyal, naive. Just uh, some descriptive words. And then what is the principal function of this character? And I've got some, uh, some, other, some other options here. Uh, next box you have is motivation. Um, what is the goal of this character? What is this character's plan to achieve this goal? And then your next option is a character background. Got a family background, habits and vices, personality, education, likes, dislikes. And that's the whole uh, character, character description item. And uh, just some other things you can do with this. You can minimize these boxes here if you want. Um, or each of these little title headings you can minimize. And just from um, a screenplay writing standpoint, even if before you even start your screenplay, it'd be a good idea to add some characters uh, or just uh, add these character items here and then fill these things out. Because you, sh you should know the background and the motivation and the physical descriptions of your characters before you even start writing. So just a, it's a, just a good idea to do that first. I mean, you don't necessarily have to, but it should make writing your screenplay a lot easier. So it's a good idea to add these characters and fill out all this information before you even get to the screenplay part. But uh, those are the different options you have um, on a character profile and the item, the character item you can add to your project library in Celtics.